so this is the problem of ranking cycle in this steam at 15 bar and 400 degree celsius it expands in turbine to 0 0.06 bar okay find out net work done per kg and ranking efficiency so for this for this we are making ts diagram like this 1 2 3 4 okay this is ts diagram here at 1 temperature is 400 degree celsius okay this is p1 it's 15 bar and this is pb it's value 0 0.06 bar okay so we need some formulas for first net work done per kg of the steam is find out by ws is equal to turbine work wt minus pump work okay so how to find turbine work is h1 minus h2 kg per sec kg per kilojoule per kg and uh, pump work is p1 minus pb by 10 this is the formula and for second ranking efficiency efficiency net work done upon heat supplied is equal to the net work done that is from this formula and upon heat supplied h1 minus h4 so now we will first find net work done formula is ws is equal to wt minus wp so wt is equal to h1 minus h2 okay so how to find the h1 and h2 okay so from steam table okay okay from steam table so we get these values h1 is equal to this and s1 is equal to this and uh, this is that super heated okay this is per heated steam and this is saturated steam okay so for, for how to get these uh, values we need steam table so here is a steam table so we now want 15 bar we have 15 bar pressure and 400 degree temperature so we need h1 value and s value so at 400 h is 3256.6 and s is 7.271 okay so after that we have 0 0.06 bar pressure of the steam so we need some values like uh, specific enthalpy and specific entropy so get the value from here like hf1 this is the value okay then next hf this is the value okay then next sfg for this is the value okay and for sf this is the value so all the values so now in given problem we have h1 value okay but here but we don't know h2 value so how to find out h2 value okay for that we have we know that s1 is equal to sf2 plus x2 sf g2 okay so from this s1 is 7.130 is equal to sf2 okay what is the value of sf2 so this is the value 0 0.521 plus x2 we don't know sf g2 this is 7.8 this is the value okay so so we get x2 is equal to 0 0.8462 okay so use this value add formula h2 is equal to hf2 plus x2 into hf g2 okay so h2 we have to find hf2 hf2 is the is 1 point sorry 151.5 plus plus x2 we get here 8462 into this is the value 2416.0 so we get h so we get this h2 value in kilojoule per kg okay so use this so now what is the turbine work is h1 minus h2 okay so we have h1 that is 3256.6 minus h2 h2 is 2195.9 okay find out this 3256.6 minus 2195.9 so we have answer so this is in kilojoule per kg okay so now we have to find pump work that is p1 minus pb by 10 so what is p1 p1 is 15 minus pb is 0 0.06 by 10 is equal to 15 minus 0 0.06 divided by 10 1.494 kilojoule per kg okay so 
after that we know that pump work is equal to h4 minus h3 so we need h4 to find out ranking efficiency here so let's find out so in this formula we have pump work 1.494 from here and we don't know h4 is equal to h what is the value of h3 so h3 value is this this is h3 okay so we have h3 value what is that 151.5 okay so from this h from this 152.99 okay kilojoule per kg so now find out first net work done formula is ws wt turbine minus pump so we have now what is the turbine work is this 10607 minus pump 1.494 so find out it 060.7 minus 1.494 so value is 19.206 in kilojoule per kg this is the network done so second is ranking efficiency so formula is net work done upon heat supplied that is h1 minus h4 so net work done is 0 1.1059.206 divided by h1 so we have value h1 is this okay so 3 2 5 6 Point six minus h4 we are find already here 1.52.99 so calculate all this okay 1059.206 divided by 3256.6 minus 152.99 so we are get final efficiency is 0 0.3412 or let's say 34.12 percent so thank you for watching.